What's up guys, today is Star Lightning 24 welcome to another video with Dark Saves the World. Guys, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you um, how to do the light in the way, no one leaves, and climb aboard of the Yar questline, guys. It's going to be part 3 of my walkthrough. Before I get into the video, guys, it's really quick. I do have a supportive creator code that you guys are more than welcome to use. All you got to do is come to the to the item shop, whether it be Battle Royale or Save the World, and just type in Dark Lightning as follows. This is D A R K L I G H T N I N G guys. That's my supported creator code. If you want to use it, it would mean so much to me. But anyways, guys, let's get right into the video. So today we're gonna to start with light the way. Light stone beacons to continue the search for Rowdy Jack's treasure. Light the stone beacons, and we had to do seven of these. No biome, guys. All you gotta do is choose a mission. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. I see y'all in there. All right, guys. So I hopped in the Autumn City. If we don't find some extremely valuable treasure soon, the ransomware will eat our files. TLDR, that kills all of us. So I've called in our best codebreaker to lead us to the treasure. That, let's face it, is not real. We are doomed, it's my fault, I'm so sorry. Inspiring speech. Eagle Eye, lead the way. Yeah, is this where we should start digging? Digging, what? No, no. No? Then why did you send us here? That note you sent? It decrypted into multiple sets of coordinates, and a clue. And I quote, Light the lamps for all to see, and then thar the treasure be. Lamps? <laughs> Guess we should get to those coordinates, and see what we find. Guys, before I examine this pirate beacon, can, can I just... From the storm shield, the can I just mention how peaceful the music but sounds in this, in this biome? Time to boot oh my goodness. You have 20 minutes to build three towers. You can build any three I'm waiting for Ray to shut up. I've marked the location of the towers on your map. You may want to collect resources before starting to build. Like, wow, that's the first time I ever hear this music. Anyways, let's get these lamps. Oh wow, look at that. Light the lamps for all to see. And then thar the treasure be. These stone beacon thingamajigs must point toward Jack's treasure when they're all lit. Awesome! I prefer whatchamacallums, but yes, your point still stands. Eagle Eye, send the next coordinates our way. Sending coordinates now. Oh, and an attached image. Ignore that, that's personal. Blow me down and call me a scuffer crawler! We're in public! I'm just excited, Blake. Can't you feel it in your veins? We're getting close. Hey! I'm excited too, but I keep the sea talk where it belongs, on the sea. Oh, I don't mind. I'm the one that signed up to help a pair of pirates. Who am I to begrudge you the odd comment about, oh, I don't know, scallywags or doubloons? See, they love it. Eagle Eye, drop anchor on the next coordinates. Roger that. The next beacon. Arr, indeed. Okay, I see what you mean. That's fun. Told ya. Can you believe it? We're really closing in on the treasure of Rowdy Jack. I know. I just keep thinking. What if Dad could see me now? Would he finally be proud of me? Would I finally be enough? I don't know you well enough for this. Oh, so Ray and Dennis get to be earnest and vulnerable, but not me. Got it. Do you... do you want those next coordinates? For the love of all that is good and holy, yes, please, Eagle Eye! Yo ho ho! Another beacon! Yar! Shiver my timbers! And, uh, speaking of my shivered timbers, uh, sorry to get so heavy at the last stop, you know what I mean? Oh, it's fine. What's a little overshared emotional trauma between associates? Hey, I've got a question. What kind of treasure are we expecting this to be, anyway? Gold? Precious stones? Semi-precious stones? 60,000 in beard coin? So we don't all die? My father dedicated his life to that treasure. Whatever it is, it'll be worth it. Trust me. In the meantime, send those next coordinates our way, would you? Yo ho ho, dead man's chest. Oh, oh, okay, here's what I've got. Yar, the chest be heavy and festooned with locks to hold its booty inside. Fortune will truly shine on the buccaneer who finds it. Well, that's certainly colorful if, uh, non-specific. 
It's gonna be good, though. I know it. Flaky, you and me are going in the record books for sure. What about us? I'm still... Oh, yeah, I mean, obviously, tons of credit coming your ways, too. Obviously. Flaky, what's the journal say about mutinies? What was that? Nothing! Set sail for the next coordinates! Oh, man! Another beacon down! The treasure of Rowdy Jack is getting so close I can practically taste it! Me too! At least, I assume that's what that taste is? Pennies again? Yeah! So weird. What's up with that? No idea. But once we're done with this, we really gotta get you to a doctor. I've already taken the liberty of scheduling checkups for you both back at home base because this conversation has been... alarming. Final coordinates coming your way, guys. What to build? Okay, that's all of them, right? Avast! Ahoy! Yeah, you got them all. Tracking beacon information, triangulating, cross-referencing... Boom! I think we've got our treasure location. Most excellent! You hear that, you salt-covered scamps? We found you your treasure! This is so friggin' cool! Let's get digging! Yeah! Thank you, everyone! This... This is amazing. Finally completing my dad's work. Me and Keels. And an assortment of heavily armed strangers with me to do it. Couldn't have done it without you guys. Bye. Yar, Blake. Yar. There it is. Well, guys, looks like that's it. That's all the dialogue we get for this part of the quest. I'm going to finish this mission. I'll see you all back in home base. All right, guys, here we are. Quest complete. Light the way. <coughs> Give you my gold. <laughs> so much gold that you get from these missions, guys. I swear, 100 gold. Let's move on. Second mission. No one leaves. This is it. Search the zone to find Rowdy Jack's treasure. Find the treasure. You might find it in any zone and find one treasure. This is interesting, guys. Honestly, I want to say that you got to do it here. No. So it looks like, huh. This is going to be a tricky one guys, but this is why we're here. I'm going to go ahead and jump into whatever zone and I'll see y'all in there. Hopefully I get to find that treasure <laughs> for this part of the pirate event. It's pretty weird because they don't specify what zone to go in, but I'm just hoping it doesn't take that long to find it. Here it is. Kiels, do you want to do the honors? You do it. You've earned it. No, you earned it. Are we really not getting any credit? Woo! <laughs> you know what? Everyone, we're opening it together. We've all worked hard to get here. I want us all to share this moment. On three. Good job, One, man. two, Keep up three. Job. I regret sharing this moment. Ahoy, geocaching enthusiast. He found Rowdy Jack's treasure? Please rebury the prize for the next round of adventurers? Oh my god! Dad was LARPing? He missed my birthday for 25 consecutive years for geocaching? Therapist Brian was right. Our family is the toxic garbage barge. We should leave. No one leaves! This secret dies with all of us! Quickly now, back to base. Okay, guys, well, there you go. That was the treasure. I'm going to finish up this mission and see what I have to do next. All right, guys. <laughs> Thankfully, we were, we were able to find the, the treasure in that one mission. So, yeah, that was No One Leaves. I got my spring tickets. Now, let's see what I have to do for the third and final quest of this video. Climb aboard. Help Director Riggs build a sea sickness cure for Blackbeard and Keelhaw. Gather swing parts to construct a sea sickness simulator found in suburban zones. 30 of these. Gosh, 30. So, they're telling you to go to suburban zones. That's where I'm going to go to. So, I'll meet you all in there. Alright, guys. Here I am in the autumn suburbs. Now, all we need to do is just find some swings, break them, and then get those swing sets. Alright, I'll shoot you. Now that we've all cooled out and agreed that no one is killing anyone. For the tenth time, yes. Maybe we can see this not as a failure, but as a chance to do better. Much better. And very, very quickly. I cannot overstate how much we need treasure. 
There is, uh, just one problem. We both get really, really seasick. Back when I managed an astronaut training camp, we used simulators to help our trainees combat motion sickness. Perhaps we could scrounge up the necessary parts to make something similar. Let's see what we can find. Yes, yes, I believe that should do quite nicely. Excellent springs, good bounce to the ounce ratio. So wait, we're gonna make a machine out of all this junk and it will just, what, cure our seasickness? Curing isn't the goal here, Blake. This will help you learn to live with your seasickness. It's healthier. Oh, like wheat bread. Yar! I suppose. Uh, let's keep looking for parts. Okay, I think I'm starting to understand this. We're gonna use all these bouncy, springy parts to build, like, a fake ship that moves like a real ship. That's right. And then attach it to the top of a monster truck so we can be pirates of the land. <gasps> land pirates. What? No, have you... Uh, do you have any idea what a simulator is? Mm, not really, no. Oh, good heavens. that you guys are making a land pirate cruiser? No, that isn't correct even a little bit. Bummer. Ah, oh, well. So, what are you guys building? We're making a simulator to help work on our seasickness. Sounds weird. Count me in. Oh, yeah. That'll be perfect. Uh, ah, there. Looking nice. That's, um... Quite the paint job you got going there. Very, uh, thrilling? Thanks, man. I think it really brings together two of my favorite things. Airbrush seascapes and airbrush skulls. Got a lot of skulls on it, that's for sure. It's supposed to be scary. My little piratical privateers to be. That means it's doing its job. Nice work, Laws. As they say, I think it's almost ready for prime time. motion intolerance testing machine is complete. The vomit machine? Climb aboard, ye scallywags! Wow, you're really getting into this, huh? To the extent that a man who finds piracy to be morally repugnant can, yes. Uh, how long do I need uh, to do this? Oh, just a few hours, Blakebeard. You're doing great. Getting swarmed! Wow! Life safe! Well guys, we finally found those dirty swing parts. I really wonder what's gonna happen to Blakebeard, but um, yeah, <laughs> that's, that's it for the dialogue for for this mission, and that's the last mission of this part of the walkthrough, so I'll see you on home base, see what's gonna happen next. Well guys, we finally completed that third mission, we got 100 gold from that. And well, <clears throat> on my next episode guys, um, I know this episode took a while to upload, but trust me, I've been pretty busy you guys have been catching my streams and all but nonetheless guys there are two episodes left to this walkthrough so on the next episode i'll be doing you shan't i'll be doing under the black flag and a bordage guys and then that leads us to the last episode which will show one step walk the plank and bottled memoranda although i have a feeling that walk the plank is going to be its own <laughs> its own mission again anyway guys thank you so much for watching and i'll catch you on the next one peace out guys